We're given five touching semicircles, each with radius two, and we're asked for the length of the perimeter of this interesting shaded shape on the inside. Well, one, a good way to help visualize what's going on here is to connect up the centers of these semicircles. I should say centers of the semicircle, I guess the centers of the circle that um, we create the semicircle from. And these will be equilateral triangles because this is gonna this is two and this is two, this is two and this is two. They're they're all two, all these radii lengths. Now this helps us because now we actually see that this is gonna be 60 degrees. And therefore, this is one sixth of a circle because 360 divided by 60 is six. So one sixth. And then I've got another one sixth here and here. So I actually have half a circle here. But I can just keep adding up the sixths, to be honest. This is going to be now four sixths in total. Five, six. That's a whole circle we have here. We'll keep on going seven, eight, nine. So we actually have nine sixths, which is three over two of a circle. And therefore the perimeter is gonna be three over two times the perimeter of one circle, which is pi times the diameter, or in this case, two pi times the radius, because we're given the radius. Of course, you can get the diameter as four and use that if you want but we're going to get four pi, two pi times two. We can cancel that out with that, which leaves us an answer of six pi. So that's a really solid way of doing this question. We could have just worked out a whole circle and then added a half, it's equivalent to three over two. The main thing in this question, the challenge is to work out how much of a circle that we've got and hopefully I've convinced you.